so Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Keys are all broken. Or maybe it's me. Crystal ah, Wells. Oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm toast head. if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Ah, gotcha. Now, Max the ninja fit? strikes. Get it? Hey, Boo, yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. <sighs> Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. Mm -hmm. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Yep. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? <laughs> Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Well, like Chloe, it, I just feel it. weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Do not Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Of course. They're both sociopaths. More like psychopaths. The Blackwell security officer even hits his own stepdaughter. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Kicking it in Los Angeles? That would be the best case scenario. She wouldn't leave without me, okay? And how often do missing girls turn up? We have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a oh, boss, this. Chloe. I, this, yeah, I, a bit I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. <laughs> that good enough? Um, yeah, no. Are you happy with that? Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Oh, hey, Hopefully the fun. rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted, as you know. It's not been a good day for Blackwell. Oh, right, yeah. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. Oh, no. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh... 
I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would I have to spend a lot of time together. Said. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Up. Way up yours. Are you fucking kidding me? Good. I'm glad that outcome. I'm very pleased that outcome. Don't it's so that. stupid. Punch up. Go on. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. You can always let me get busted, like you did with the weed. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? I can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell Security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on, one more door and our work here is done. You did save her, right? Thank you for finally acknowledging that. She didn't suddenly listen to the wind and come on. Speak. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit. Like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking. Thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief okay. skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Why, yes, I could. Nothing here. Dead end. We're dirty, leaving it around, to be honest. Boring. Crap. Really? Who oh got the circle that one again? There's crap in that one. Bullseye. Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Its name is Warren for Dark Knight. Hey, Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Oh, uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Press yes, I'm button still button all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the hope. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon.
powers they used to create chlorine dioxide. Shit, everybody knows that. So, are you really going to try this? Can you let try? I'm out of wisdom. What's the new thing here? Oh, there's quite a few pages. Uh, I'm gonna put a skip button probably, in case you want to skip this. to rewind time and I ended up on the rooftop trying to stop my friend from jumping off while to trying to prevent the possible destruction of my hometown. I fell asleep at my desk and woke up reaching out to rewind or grab Kate. Remember when my journal entries were about which anime character I wanted to be or my dreams of being a respected globe hopping photographer or what me and Chloe would be doing when we were finally adults. At least we know how that turned out so far. Chloe's determined to get to the bottom of what is going on, so I've been playing What Would Chloe Do? Which means blowing off my black wall. I might to research everything I can on to find out Kate Marsh, Rachel Amber, and the esteemed Prescotts. It would be too easy for you to see if they were all connected, but at this point, I think the whole town of Arcadia Bay is connected to this crazy ship, and I can already see the story on a National Geographic channel. Mystic, scientific, or apocalyptic. The Arcadia Bay Tornado. Shut up. Speaking of the air, I still think about Kate and the sadness in her eyes on that roof. I'm so grateful that she's alive. I hope seeing the students of Blackwell show their support. So good. What the hell is that? <laughs> show their support for life. <laughs> I heard something in the back. I don't know if you heard it. With gifts and flowers, finally. At least I feel better than now that Nathan is suspended. It's good he's off campus for a few days, I hope. And like I give a shit if the Prescott family sends a team of lawyers after me. Please. I doubt they would like all the publicity. I doubt their tentacles reach into the wet rest. I try to say west, but it sounds like rest as well. <laughs> of Oregon. Not yet, anyway. Right, I'm going to be back real quick because I can hear shouting <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> Uh, what's happening weapons of Rachel if anything it's funny that even though I think I can just rewind myself out of trouble I'm in more trouble now than ever before in my life if this was a Twilight Zone story I'd be set up some, some serious irony <sighs> like I'm going to rewind myself out of existence or something can I honestly say I'll have this ability for the rest of my life for the tornado and snow that not an <laughs> eclipse, just hallucinations, or are they genuine prophecy? More importantly, is this a curse or a blessing? Chloe's alive and by my side, and that has to be a miracle, which means there must be a way to stop my vision from coming true, right? So yes, I broke curfew to hook up with Chloe. She said she had something to show me. Looks like it's time for some serious detective work. Enter the Blackwell Ninja. As I stealthily made my way out to the hall, I passed by Kate's door and saw all the nice messages from the other students. Too bad most of Blackwell didn't care when they passed around the video and bullied her to that roof. Everybody always cares when it's too late. At least Kate will see that people are on her side, finally. I hope I can visit her when all this blows over. Maybe that's not a good choice of words. Oh, because the tornado came. Ha ha ha. Damn! That was too close. I was doing so well until I got outside, and of course, it was principal wows of all. People blocking the way. The one person I least wanted to see. I wasn't ninja enough for him, so yeah. No, he didn't! Mm. Ah, gotcha. Now. Max the ninja bitch. strikes again. No, he didn't. He didn't. He really didn't. What? Did he bust me? I didn't think he did. Okay. I finally got to see what the gossip was about for a change. Principal Waz was so... Sh Principal Waz was shit-faced. He didn't even try to hide it. In fact, he was a lot colder than drunk. Drunk and sober. I can see why he's so confused dealing with Kate's family and the Prescotts and David and Madsen. He still acts suspicious and gives me way too much to chewed. As he would say, nobody takes that seriously. 
though I can see that he's under a lot of pressure, so much so that he's wasted. He can't even use his keys at midnight. Sure, he was in my way, but he was no match for my rewind pup. What? You literally just said that you got caught. I have no idea. After all, I had to go and meet Chloe. Bad Max. Batman, Batman, but Batman, it's okay. Even though I thought I was in full ninja mode, Chloe still scared the shit out of me, which pissed me off considering what I've been going through. Sometimes she's so damn intensive to other people's feelings. She wants all the, my attention for her and finding Rachel, and she gets all but her if I don't have time for her. Obviously, I have time in hand, but I can't stay mad at her for long. She was so damn excited about having the keys to the main building. Honestly, I was pretty amped too. Even more so when we were at, went out to the front of the building and spied on Victoria talking smack about my shocked. About me, even not my shocked. And worst, and worse, I actually trying to blackmail Mr. Jefferson to pick her photo for the Everyday Heroes contest. She is freaking unreal. I'll just put fucking it in earlier. I gave Mr. Jefferson major respect for telling her to get lost, even though she deserved to be expelled for pulling that crap. There we go. That's... I don't know. Anyway, this is her priority after what happened with Kate. I just don't understand Victoria. No matter how I try, she's already rich and pretty. Oh, piss off, she's pretty. She looks ugh. And a good photographer. Mm, I haven't seen any photos of her, so that still should be judged. Why try her so hard and hurt so many to manipulate everything already in your favour? I just hope that's not what I'm doing with my rewind. Rewind power. Yes, there's something, cr something incredibly awesome about breaking into your own school at the witching hour. Although Chloe was technically right, how can we break in with a key? Never mind that it was a stolen key from the school's head of security. Anyway, the Black Crown Ninjas strike again. Alright. Now that we're done, I'm just gonna see if I can find the choice. Oh, there's the choices. No, those are the big choices. Okay, never mind. Doesn't matter. Right, sugar we need. Ooh, sugar. Only three more items to go. Only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. What was it? She fucking baseball red hat. Search now. Look. I feel bad for the twee hipster who lost this beret. I bet he's cute. Squirrels like nuts. Does that mean Samuel is. Nah. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. We found one. What do you know? Trash. Different. Nerd alert. This poster has Warren written all over it. You're nice to as it always helps you out. No can here. Yes, this poster must stop bullies dead in their tracks. So glad you still have your locker, Kate. Anybody drink sodas here?
release the crack hand. Nothing in it. That formal and smell. An A minus? All right, all right. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. I never said they were great, troll. Max, if you can't right find sodium sense. chlorate in the science lab, <laughs> give it up. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Look. Here's the sodium chlorate box. Right. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. You're halfway home, Max. Still there? Did you blow up? Max? Still here, didn't blow up. Not yet. I need to concentrate now. TTYL. I'm bad at the bloody text stuff. I don't know why. I don't know what TTYL means. Or Okay, I have the can. Ingredient left. Yep, duct tape. Oh, what can we go in here? This is probably something to do with that. This is like a scene in a horror film. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. It's not. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. I, pr 
probably the tape is mine. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Also, um, there should be a webcam, or you should be able to see my face um, when I install the webcam. At the moment, I'm waiting for an extension called cam so I can plug it in and just blend up stuff I need to plug in. Um, so, yeah. But hopefully, you're all enjoying this video. So glad you still have your locker, Kate. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Ooh, literally. Yes, time to blow shit up. If you'll light the candle. This is so cool. Get ready to haul ass. That was so fucking cool. Oh, we are toast! Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? She can't cheat with her rewind. Well, too late. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister.